Hi hi, and Tar1011 here, and I've got a battle for you today against Frosty Pixie! So, uh, backstory on this battle, we had this a long, long time ago. I was really torn about whether to upload it or not, or if I was going to upload it. Maybe I should upload it in some way that would be kind of hidden, because I'm a little bit embarrassed about this battle. Because there was some confusion, basically, I didn't know... Oh, you're gonna see in a minute. So I lead off with my Neela, my Natu, and I'm gonna go ahead and set up a light screen, knowing that can't set up stealth rocks against me, can't really do anything against me once I'm behind a light screen, or so I figured. Uh, Icy Wind is going to be super effective, and it's going to get a critical hit, and that is going to take out Neela first turn, and that is less than fortunate. But oh well, I'm going to go ahead and send out Angler, my Chin Chow here, uh, my Eviolai Chin Chow, as my opponent is going to go ahead and withdraw Piplup, and I should have predicted this, I should have, I feel so stupid, of course Glyger comes out, this was right before Glyger went uh, uber, but oh well. So yeah, uh, my opponent's going to get off a free sword stance, and... Uh, I'm gonna actually stay in, and she sees this and she's like, you stayed in, why did you stay in? I don't understand why you stayed in, you should have switched out. And I said, well, I was actually predicting you did Swords Dance, but the other thing is that I run Eviolite, so there's actually a good chance I could have taken it. And she said, you run Eviolite? I, I don't play with Eviolite. I'm like, you don't? Oh, I'm so sorry. It's like, yeah, it's all over my channel. I'm like, oh, I'm so sorry. I had no idea. Uh, because I guess I hadn't been watching many of her videos recently. I'd missed a few. And I'm like, I'm so sorry, Sasha. And she's like, eh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. But there's a reason that you're not seeing this battle up on her channel, even though she uploads pretty much everything, or so she says. So, yeah, this is an EVO Light Chin Chow. Sasha, because she's ADD, does not like playing with EVO Light in Little Cup, uh, which I kind of understand. But so I've now swept through two of uh, her Pokemon with my Chin Chow. And, you know, that's actually not as great as it's done sometimes because, a little spoiler alert, uh, I'm gonna get taken out by that mind poop. I'm gonna go ahead and go for the Scald here. Uh, I actually should have gone for the, the uh, T-Wave, I think. Uh, but anyway, High Jump Kick is going to KO Chin Chow, and so only two KOs, that's actually rather respectable for my Chin Chow. Anyway, I'm predicting that my opponent here, well, I mean, there's basically only two sets that uh, Mind Fruit runs. It's either Eviolite or Scarf. So now knowing that it's not Eviolite, it must be Scarfed. So Switch was great. I get a free sub up as, as my opponent sends out a Wild's face because, yeah, it, Dino looks like a Wild Chase. Uh, so anyway, I'm going to go ahead and go for the Sludge Bomb. I get a crit. Not 100% sure that that crit mattered because, again, Eviolite's not legal and Sean is freaking amazing what with Life Orb and I believe it's mild so that's plus special attack nature. Out comes Mindfu, and even though the payback is fairly obvious, all it's going to do is break my sub, and I'm going to be able to KO on the next turn. I'm not sure why I went for the Shadow Ball rather than the Sludge Bomb here. Sorry, I'm getting a little bit ahead of my battle here with my narration. So yeah, I go for the Shadow Ball here instead of the Sludge Bomb. Not sure why, but it KOs, so it's all great. And yeah, so Sean loses some HP. My opponent's going to go ahead and send out uh, Piplup, uh, I'm gonna be faster, I'm gonna go for the Sludge Bomb, it's gonna do the most damage, and I'm pretty sure it's gonna take it out, and indeed it does. So I've, I'm sweeping through her entire team with my Ghastly, and my opponent's gonna send out her last Pokémon, I believe, which is Golurk. I've got the Shadow Ball, this isn't even gonna be close. Shadow Ball is going to hit, and is going to KO that Golurk, since it really couldn't have survived, probably even if it had been Eviolite. So yeah... Yeah, uh, so I've defeated Frosty Pixie, but I really didn't feel good about that. Now, here's the thing, though. If I had uh, not been running Eviolite, it would have been running uh, Air Balloons, so it still would have been a great counter to Gligar. So, yeah, I, Sasha, I'm really sorry about that. If you ever want to battle me again, I doubt you watch these battles anyway, so what am I saying? Anyway, I heart you all. Later. Eee!